Hello everyone. Uh, so I'm going to demo uh, a project uh, that I've been realized during uh, some Mac days, and which is about to log uh, what's happening during a connection. Uh, so I'm starting with a brand new connection from end-to-end uh, -end testing to an end-to-end -end testing to be able to show what's going to happen when there is a success, when there is a failure. Uh, and as you can see, there is a new tab here, which is events. Uh, currently, the events is only about like the connection being created, which was one minute ago. Uh, now I'm going to proceed and start a sync. Um, and we can go back into the event tab and see that now it logged that a manual uh, connection has been requested, that a replication has started, and within this replication, several tasks have started. The first one is the destination pool. Uh, which is trying to get a state message from the destination. State message, when we receive it, it means that those uh, records have been committed and pushed to the destination. Uh, source pool is about like pulling data from the source. Destination push is about like pushing data from the source. And so I can see for all of those steps, uh, when they started and when they completed. Um, this is important. So for example, you can see that you stop, you completed the pooling, and uh, you are still waiting for the destination to push all the records. And you can see the difference between uh, when you stop pulling data from your uh, source and when you stop pushing data from your to your destination. Uh, okay, and so what's happening in case of an error? So I'm going to modify the destination to uh, throw an error. So it's going to fail after two message. I'm saving the destination, going back to my connection, and running new sync. So this new sync failed. Uh, and I can see that my replication failed, and it failed in the step where I was trying to fetch a, a state from the destination. Um, if I didn't manage to push to the destination, this task would have failed. Uh, this one is completed. Um, the message here is a message uh, that has been chosen for the POC. This is not the most explicit one, and we, I think we can come up with something uh, more meaningful. Um, and now, uh, let's put back the destination to a successful one. and switch the source to a failing one. And after to record. So now uh, we will be able to see that the source is failing into the event. So waiting for the job to complete, uh, origin source, and if we look at the events, we can see that uh, the source didn't exit properly. Here, we have a message that is pretty useful, uh, which says that the destination got terminated because there was an issue with the source. And so that can explain why all the messages have not been pushed to the destination. Uh, and even if the destination is green, because there was no issue with that, uh, the platform, the Airby platform, decided to finish the destination because, because it was not able to pull any data from the source anymore. And yeah, so that's about it. Um, currently, the Hack Days also contains updates. So for example, if I disable my connection, uh, I can see it logged here. Uh, Maybe in the future, we will add a user uh, ID and a username to this information uh, and uh, to make it uh, easier to understand what change have been done to a connection setting and by who. All right. Thank you for uh, listening and looking at this demo. So that's uh, all for me. And uh, thank you.